Have you ever felt alone? Like, truly alone? Even if there are other people around you, you are trapped within your own mind? Or you just don't feel like you're connecting with anyone? That's exactly what I felt like when I... Well, I either drew, or I colored in, or I did something with all of these. Most of them are original works by me, 100% original. But as you've noticed with some of these ones that are at the beginning, there's a common theme. It's not in all of them, but back then I was really, truly alone. I was in the middle of nowhere living with my grandparents. It took me half an hour of driving just to get anywhere. And there weren't anyone. Sorry, there wasn't anyone around me who really got me. It was mainly old people or kids who were going to the schools who hadn't left town yet. And even in the surrounding towns, it was usually people live there, and if they could get out, they could. So, I was really alone. This piece that you're looking at right now is actually the first thing that my wife and I worked on together. So, yeah, it's that old. It's All of these were created within like a, a two or three year period back in nine, ten years ago, maybe eight, just within that time span. And that's when I really drew into myself. And I've been thinking about how to do this video all week. And I knew that I wanted to do this. But I really didn't know how to get into it or how to do anything because, well, I don't really like going back to that time of my life. I was really just angry at everything, including myself, and it wasn't a happy time for me. There was one real friend that I had until my wife came along. Um, there was another friend I met shortly after her, but it was definitely a point in my life where I was alone. I could talk to my grandparents, but they didn't understand me. They just knew that I liked being on the computer and I liked drawing. They also knew about my enjoyment of writing, but my grandmother wrote western stories. So, not really something that her and I could talk about. She's not that big into the whole fantasy thing. Or even young adults, since I kind of melt the two together when I write. But, yeah. So, I'm not really sure how to get into this. I know last week's video was kind of emotional for me, just how I was relieved with things, and I do have a few happy things to report, but I do want to know, guys, when was a time where you felt really alone, like you had nobody you could turn to, and if you've never had that, tell me what you think it would feel like. Please, comment down below in the description just any thoughts on true loneliness. And, yeah, I really want to, to hear what it's like for some of you guys. And as you can tell, I'm kind of stuttering a, a little bit. I'm kind of anxious over this and kind of unsure of really how to approach a lot of it just due to the fact that my emotions have been everywhere lately. I, I think this might be the most, like, real I've been in a video for a while. I know last week there were some tears and, and such, but that was just... It was 
real and I haven't been hiding any things, but there are times when I'm doing videos where I don't feel like I should really emote as strongly. But then there are times like right now where I don't know what else to do, I guess. Right now, I'm kind of worried that we're losing another stranger. I know that our dear friend hasn't really done much as far as posting videos. We've seen a few of her, but, well not her, them, since that's her preferred, their preferred pronoun, sorry. I kind of mess up when I'm really emotional. I, I want all of us to stay along. I want all of us to continue to make videos because I love you guys and I enjoy how things are. So, um, before we get into the end here, and I do know that it's almost to the end just because there are only a few pictures left to go through, but before we get to the very end, I do have a few questions for you guys. Um, first and foremost, like I said before, your thoughts on loneliness. Whether you've been lonely or what you think loneliness truly feels like. Two, what do you guys want to do with Wednesday? And three, I have yet to, s sorry, I have yet to see anyone say anything on the Project for Awesome, so please, let's figure out what to do for the Project for Awesome. And for that, this is over. I'll see all of you guys next week. Love you guys. Bye-bye.